Hi, I'm Mira from Alaya Pilates. This is a level two flow mat. I will be taking you from intermediate to a low advanced Basi Pilates mat exercises in a style of a Basi flow. Each exercise will transition to the next, creating a nice fluid and smooth workout. So let's begin. We're going to start lying on our backs. So lying supine, I just want you to settle your body here, palms facing down, feet up, hip width apart, parallel, chest is nice and opened. You may close your eyes for a second. Allow your body to arrive on a mat. Let's dedicate this workout just for yourself. Let's inhale, taking as much air as you can, and then exhale, allow the air to come out and release out of the body. And then deep inhalation again, and then deep exhalation. Allow the sensation of the skin touching to the mat or the grounders of the body to be a little bit more significant. Increase your awareness of the body. Just really allow the body to settle and arrive on the mat. Clear your mind. Connect your breath a little bit more. Connect your breath a little bit more, a little deeper. And let's give your best focus, dedication to this workout. Take one more inhalation. And we exhale. Let's begin. We're taking into a pelvic curl here. We inhale. Now as you exhale, I need to draw the lower abs. I need to go ahead and imprint that lower back onto the floor, create a really deep flexion in the lower back. And let's take the spine up as you articulate the spine right up into that bridge position. Reaching out through your knees to your toes. Inhale. And then exhale, allow the body to articulate down, taking every single vertebra on that spine or in that spine to go down to the floor one at a time and coming back into the neutral position. Let's go again as you breathe out, drawing that lower abs, a deep, deep flexion into the spine as you peel the spine off the floor, coming onto that bridge position. We inhale. And then we exhale, allow the body to melt down, articulating down, and then release the pelvis, lengthening the tailbone at end. Let's go two more like so. Exhale, we'll take it up. I like to think this as a massage to the spine before we start our workout. And then exhale, we roll down. And keeping that alignment of the thighs. And then exhale, roll it up again. And increasing that connection of your adductors in between your thighs, the inner thighs, nice and strong, nice and clear in the body. And then exhale, we'll take it down again. And we roll it up again, up to that bridge. And then here, as you go down, I want you to go ahead and roll, lift the arms up, float them up, and then take the arms overhead as the spine travels down to the floor. And go ahead and roll the pelvis up again. The arms will travel up to the ceiling and down over towards the feet. Inhale, and then exhale, melting the spine. The arms travel up and overhead, taking care of your ribs and not pushing out, not sticking out, draw it down one more time. And exhale, roll the pelvis up, bring it up onto the bridge, arms come right by the side, and then exhale, articulate the spine down, the arms comes right over the head, and then go ahead and interlace the fingers 
place the hands behind the back of your head. And now on moving on onto our chest lift. We breathe out, we flex the spine, we hold and exhale, we take it down. We breathe out, we flex the chest, in breath and exhale, return. And an exhale again. Try to keep that pelvis quiet. Inhale. And an exhale, even though the abdominals is really busy. But I want you to, as we come up, keep that neutral position of the pelvis, but keep the abdominal really scooped in. And now let's take it down one more time. We breathe out. We come up. We inhale, hold. And then we exhale, let's take it down. And go, coming up again onto the chest lift. Let's hold that. Now one, two, two, breathe out. We curl that pelvis, imprint that lower back. Inhale, release. Two more, scoop, imprint that lower back, deepening up the connection of lower abs. Inhale, release. One more time, exhale. Inhale, release. And then come back down to the floor. Let's take it into the obliques, chest lift. We exhale, coming up, inhale with twist. Sorry, we come back, back to the center. Let's go down again, let me take it again. Exhale, we come up, let's hold it and inhale, and exhale, we rotate. Inhale, center. Exhale, we twist. Inhale, center. And we twist. Inhale, center. Try to get that shoulder blades off the floor. And then we rotate, and rotating from that waistline. And let's do one more each side. Exhale, twist, and center. And the last one, twist, and center, and coming down. Well done. I want you to go ahead and extend the legs forward, stretch the legs long, reach it out. Take your arms overhead. Connect the upper quadrant of the abdominal towards the belly button. Let's take it to the roll-ups here. We inhale, the arms comes up, followed by the head lift, chest lift, arms are forward. As you exhale, pull in, deep into that center. Bring your body over into that C curve. Inhale, hold. Exhale, we need to take the sacrum down and create a nice deep flexion in the spine. And then let's take your arms overhead. Repeat again, we inhale, taking the arms up, lifting the chest into a chest lift, and then exhale as you pull the center in, you bring the body over your hips. Inhale, stay, and then exhale, let's rock the pelvis back. Deep flexion in that spine to get the sacrum down, lower back down, and the arms follow through. Let's do one more time. Arms, head lift, chest lift, gaze is forward, hold. And exhale, come up, come up into that C curve. And then go ahead and roll the spine back. Deep, deep flexion in the spine. And then let's take the arms overhead. Circle the arms out to the T position. Floating one leg up to the tabletop. And then second leg up to the tabletop. Drawing the inner thighs tight together. Let's go ahead into a supine spine twist. Over to the, towards me as you inhale. And then exhale, return yourself back to the center. Over to the other side, opposite shoulder stays down on the floor. And exhale, bring it back. And then inhale, over. This is my left. Exhale, I'm bringing my right oblique in to the center and then over to my right. And my left shoulder stays down and an exhale, connecting my left oblique as I take my body back to the center. Let's do one more each side. And then inhale, over to my left, right shoulder stays down, exhale, right obliques in, and back to the middle, last one, inhale. And exhale, come back, come back, come back. Well done, take your arms overhead, it's time for the hundreds. We breathe out, we lift that chest, we take the legs up to the ceiling, and then let's take it to the hundreds. We breathe out, and inhale, three, four, five, and exhale, 
and inhale and exhale and and one more set like so and in. now let's take the legs lower here okay keep the arms pumping and inhale and exhale and in breath and three more set keep reaching the arms long the shoulders is open and two more set and in breath and the last set out and inhale and hold I want you to drag the knees and pull it in pull it in pull it in pull it in and hold grab the shin lift that chest higher into a deeper flexion here curl that pelvis up I want you to rock that spine just rock it up we're gonna do two more here and then we're gonna arrive in a seated position last one and coming up all right onto rolling like a ball right hands on that shin bone feet are off the floor balancing on that tailbone gaze into the center let's go inhale we roll back exhale balance inhale and exhale keep the head off the floor and an exhale and in three more and an exhale and two and back and the last one and we arrive feet down and then i want you to just elongate lift the spine tall grow tall grow tall and taller shoulders nice and wide neck nice and easy and moving on to our double leg stretch we're going to lift the heels up i'm going to curl that spine going into really deep flexion in the spine then transfer your hand towards the knee and I want you to bring that body into that double leg stretch position we go inhaling reach the arms and the legs exhale inhale like a boomerang we're going to create that nice shape and exhale inhale reach arms and the legs and exhale two more reach and exhale last one reach and single leg stretch. I'm gonna stretch my left leg long, my right hand. Sorry, my hand's gonna be on my right knee. I'm gonna lift that chest a little higher, hold. And then we switch as we breathe that. Change. Taking care that your feet are the same height in front of you. You're gonna stretch your legs out and then pull it in. And then stretch your legs out and then pull it in. And again, out and then in. And then out one more set last one hold interlace the fingers behind your head here onto the crisscross we twist towards that bent knee and we switch and we switch we switch keep that pelvis stable gaze nice and forward ahead of you and one more each side last one coming back to the center holding 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 and release lower one foot down second one down arms by the side take a moment inhale and bring your whole focus back onto your center we're going to float one leg up to the tabletop second leg up to tabletop onto our rollover we stretch the legs about 60 degrees here we take it up about 90 press the arms we're going to curl that pelvis press the arms down bring that legs over 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 flex the feet separate lower the feet down press down onto the floor if you can and then go ahead and roll the spine down reaching the arms away reach it out reach it out reach it up point the feet circle the legs Bring them together, legs up to 90, press the arms and then we're gonna curl. Bring the leg over, 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 we flex, separate, we lower, in breath. And then go ahead and roll back, keep reaching the fingertips away, draw the shoulders down and then circle. Let's do two more times and up and then curl it over, 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 we flex, separate, and we take it down and roll the spine back back 
back, bottom down, point of fist, circle the legs. Last one, take it up. And curl over, 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 flex, separate, and down. And we go ahead and roll the spine back, 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 point, circle, together. Folding the knees, one foot down, second down, hold, lift the head and the chest up, grab the back of your thigh, take an in breath here. Exhale, let's bring your body up into a deep, deep flexion, and then we come up. Okay, adjust your body, stretch the legs, separate the feet, hip width apart, just slightly wider, that's fine. We're gonna go into a spine stretch. So. Sitting up nice and tall. All right, engaging the deep back muscle as well as the abdominal equally. So let's go ahead. Articulate the spine down as you breathe out. In breath. And exhale, roll the spine up. Take it up to an upright position. One more like so. Exhale, articulate down. And just hinge forward a little bit at the end. And then exhale, rolling up, rolling up, lifting up, and tall. Let's add some extension here. So go ahead and roll the spine down. Now here, we're going to inhale as you take the arms next to your ears, creating a good length of that spine, a diagonal position, hold. And then go ahead and flex that spine forward again and stack up the spine, stack it up, upright. One more like so, and we articulate down, and we inhale, we reach it out, reach it out, reach it out, and let's hold here, guys. So here, let's add some shoulder flexion. We're gonna pull the arms back for 10. Still growing tall, and four, five, six, Seven, eight, nine, last one, ten. Hold and go ahead and flex the spine forward and roll it up and up and up and arrive. Okay, now grab your ankles. All right, onto our open leg rocker. Bringing the legs up, balance on your tailbone, scooping that abs nice and strong, take the legs up into a little wide tabletop, and then go ahead and stretch the legs, reach it out, elongate the spine, neck nice and easy. Okay, we'll go, we inhale to roll back to the shoulder, exhale, we need to reach the leg away as you grow the spine a lot taller than you can think of. And again, inhale, back, head off the floor, and then exhale, lift, elongate, and then back, and then exhale, lift, lift, and keep lifting. And two more, inhale. Never stop lifting, keep growing that spine tall. And one more, even if you think you can't go anymore, there's still a little bit more in you. Let's do one more time actually, let's go one more, last one. And then coming up, balancing, lift. Great, legs together, bend the knees. Feet down, hip width apart, arms are forward. We roll down again. Roll it, roll it, and arrived. Bring the feet closer towards the bottom. We are gonna go into some shoulder bridge prep series. So we're gonna head and scoop that belly in, curl that pelvis, and bring that pelvis up onto the bridge. Hold that pelvis, stabilize the pelvis. Have a good, nice grounding feeling on your feet. Stabilize the left foot down, and let's take the right leg up to the table, top. We inhale, tap, exhale, and we tap, and we tap, three, two, and the last whole foot goes down. Press the right foot down, lift the pelvis a tad higher, and now let's take the left foot up to the table top. We in, and then exhale, and then down. The arms are nice and grounded, and they're active. Three more, two, 
two, last, hold, take the foot down, press the feet firmly, lift the bum cheek up a little higher, hold it, hold it, hold it, and go ahead and roll it down, roll it down, roll it down, roll it down, really stretch your legs away again, arms overhead for the roll up, we inhale, lifting up, into chest lift, align to legs and muscle be crooked. And then exhale, come up, come up, come up, and lift the back. Good job. All right, moving on to our back support, and then we're gonna go into leg pull back. And then we go into our front support and moving on to leg pull front. Okay, here we are. Fingertips facing towards your bum cheek or to the side if you need to. Shall we press the heels, lift the hips, feet are down, chest is open, neck is long, hold. Hinge down, proud chest, long neck. Three more, press it up. And then down. Two more, and press it up, nice and strong here. And then down. Last one, press it up, we hold, hold, hold. Let's go to leg pull back. Kicking six time with the right leg and a six time the left leg. We go up, two, three, four, five. Last release, other leg, we go. Two, three, four, two more. Last one, hold the bottom and come down. Good job. Now bend the knee, cross the leg, transfer your body forward into a quadruped position. All right, chest nice and proud again. Onto our front support here. We're gonna take your right foot long behind you. And then second, long behind you. Chest nice and active, abdominals active. Right knee in. And then out, left, and then out, right, and then out, left, and then out, right, left, two more, set, left, last set, last one, and hold strong, leg pull front, point your right foot, we kick up six, and then two, and three, and four, and five, and six, down, other leg point, and two, and three, and four, and five, and six, take the foot down, one knee in, second one knee, and we stay here for a second, onto our cat stretch here, so we breathe out, push the floor again, Sorry, push the floor away, rounding the spine into a flat. Inhale, arch into a flat. Exhale, rounding and flat. And inhale and flat. Two more times. Exhale, flexing the back. And elongate the spine and arch the spine up. And then flat. One more time. Exhale and flat, inhale, upper arch, and flat. Okay, transfer your body down onto the floor. All right, just gonna move my mic to the side here, guys, sorry. Okay, stretch the arms long. We're gonna move on to a swimming, to swimming here, so, neck is nice and long. I want you to draw that lower abs nice and strong. We're gonna float the legs up. We're gonna float the arms up. And then we're going to tap it up. Inhale. And then exhale. And in breath. And exhale. And reach. And exhale. Three more sets. And exhale. Two more sets. And exhale. And the last set. And exhale. Hold and release. Hands underneath the armpit. 
push the floor again. And then go ahead and sit the pelvis back onto your heels, reaching the arms away from the pelvis. We're just gonna stay here for a bit, short bit. Inhale, exhale. One more time, inhale. And exhale. And let's go ahead and roll the spine up and then bring your legs forward. Okay. All right. So I'm moving on to our saw here, guys. Sitting up nice and tall again, hip slightly wider than the pelvis. All right. Let's take your arms to the side, nice and tall. I'm going to rotate towards you. We're going to twist, switch the arm, hinge forward. And now let's take it up, arms, twist. And, and exhale, and then bring it up, and center, and in, and exhale, and then lift, and center, and in breath, and exhale, and then lift, arm center, last set, twist, and so, lift, and center. Last one, twist, arms, so, and lift, arms, and center. Turn the palms up, feet together for your spine twist. All right, allow the shoulder to relax down a little bit more. Pull the toes back to you. Let's go, double breath towards me. Inhale, exhale, in breath, exhale, in breath, exhale, in breath, two more sets, and stay nice and tall, last one, last, I mean last set before, and then release, rotate your body towards me, moving on into a side kick, so stretch the legs long, onto our elbow, I want you to, I'd like you to arrive to this position in your arm. Fingertips sort of just touching the temple of the head, okay? A nice straight line from the elbows so all the way to the other elbow. Reach the top leg away, flex the foot. We go forward, double kick. Inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale, inhale, reach, exhale, inhale, reach. Last one, inhale, reach, reach, legs together, release. Coming on to this mermaid position, we're going to go into a side bend here. So your lat muscle, your shoulders needs to be ready before you push up. Shall we, opening up that chest. We go ahead and stretch the leg away, reach the arms up and over. And up, and then down. We go in, and exhale, over, and lift, and down. Two more, and lift, and exhale, and lifting up, and down. One more, lift, and exhale, over, and lift, and come down, well done. Bring your feet in closer towards the bottom. All right, the underneath up will, arm will come up now. Reach it up to the ceiling and go ahead into a lateral stretch over to the other side. I want you to actively pull up onto the open side and exhale, bring it to a little deeper, deeper stretch and release. Swing your leg over to the other side. We have the side kick. And the side bend as well. Stretch your legs aligned with the pelvis here onto your elbow. Reach long, find a balance. Leg comes up, we flex. We go, inhale, exhale, inhale. Strong waistline pulling in, exhale, inhale. Two more sets. Last set. Come back to the center and release. Let go of the arms. Coming up, 
for the side bend. Position, open up the chest, connect the lats, connect the arms. We go, stretch the legs away, lift the arm and over, side bend, arm, and then we go down. We inhale, lift, and exhale. Inhale, and exhale. Two more. Inhale, lift, and exhale. Inhale, lift, and one last one. We go, inhale, lift, exhale, and lift, and come down. Well done. Bring the feet closer towards the bottom. And then my underneath arm, my right arm will come up to the ceiling. I'm gonna reach my arm as long as I can. I'm gonna lateral bend my body over to the left side. And inhale. Exhale. One more. And we come up. Excellent. Onto our forearm. Onto our belly. For a single leg kick here. Okay. So, into tripod arms, open the collarbone, bring the chest bone up and away, be present, looking forward in front of you, reach the legs off the floor, starting with the right leg, we double kick, and inhale, and exhale, 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 inhale. Chest is open. Two more set. Last set. And extend the legs straight, straight, straight. And release. Turn your head towards me for the double leg kick here. I'm gonna interlace my hand and small of my back. All right, so one cheek. I have my right cheek on the floor. And I'm looking towards the camera, which is my left side. I'm gonna take my legs up off the floor, and we go. Kicking three, two, one. Inhale, reach the legs, lift the arms off your bottom. Lift the chest up, head over to the other side, please. And kick, two, three, inhale, reach, lift, lift. And other side, inhale. Lift, 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 other side. Inhale, lift, lift, last side. We go, kick, two, three, and a lift, reach away. And last one, kick, two, three. Inhale, lift, reach away, and we release. Well done, transfer your hands underneath the shoulder, push the floor away. And then sit, sit the pelvis back to your heels for another rest position. Inhale. And exhale. One more time. Inhale. And exhale, rolling the body up. We're not done yet. We're gonna bring the leg forward. Okay, stretch your legs away. I got messy hair. All right. Legs are long, arms are forward. Let's take your body down. All right, so we've got corkscrew, and then we've got a teaser prep. Maybe a teaser one, we'll see how we go. So go ahead and roll the spine back, back, back. Take your arms by the side, lying on your back. One, bend the knees, bend the knees. Legs up, one, and two. Stretch your legs up to the ceiling. All right, I'm gonna go to my left first. We're gonna inhale and exhale. Over to the side and then center. And then twist to the right, exhale, left. And then center to the left, exhale, right. And then center to the right, exhale. And last set to the left and exhale down. And center. Last one, turn right, and exhale down, over left. And bam, bend the knees. Holding, holding, holding. We come up, 
to a chest lift and then we go we come in lifting rolling up rolling up rolling up and exhale rocking back 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 to that chest lift again and roll it up 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 nice and tall here and exhale rock the pelvis back 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 and Let's take your feet down. I'm a little bit crooked here, sorry. Let's bring the legs up again. And go ahead and two more. And an inhale, lifting, lifting, lifting. Exhale, and down. Much better placement for my pelvis. One more time, and an inhale, lifting up, lifting up, lifting up, hold. And you know what, let's do tease of one. Let's do two of three of these. Stretch your legs, reach your arms, and we go down. Arms overhead lift up with the arms and down overhead lift and back one more down overhead lean lift and come up ho ho good job bend the knee knees apart and just stretch your body forward and one set of breath, inhale, and we exhale, roll yourself up, legs together, swing your legs behind you, onto a rocking prep, grab the ankles, we're just going to do rocking prep, and then we've got seal puppy, I think it's finito, all right, so grab the ankle, all right, here we go, press the leg, inhale, Lifting, reaching the legs up, and then come down, and then again, inhale, press the feet into your hand, lift the thighs up, pull the chest up, and then come back, let's go two more, and then inhale, lift, reach up, tall, and coming down, and the last one, inhale, lifting, reaching, pulling up, and we come back. All right, release the leg, push it back, sit the pelvis back, and roll it up. Bring the leg forward for the seal puppy. Okay, so one elbow underneath the knee, hand over the foot, second one, underneath the knee, over the foot. Okay, I'm gonna draw the knees towards the shoulder, but I want you to push that shoulder away actively. All right, rounding that back. We're gonna do six sets, maybe, shall we? We roll back, clap, three, two, one, and then forward, and, and back, clap, 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 and forward, clap, 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 and back, clap, 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 forward, Back, clap, clap, forward, look to a center, and clap, 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 and forward. I lost count, let's do one more. Clap, 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 and forward, clap, 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 and release. All right, I just bring your feet together. I'm gonna face you, or diagonally, all right? Okay. Just grab the ankles, sit nice and tall, inhaling allow the spine to grow, 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 shoulder, relax, 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 one more, inhale, grow, and I want you to just take your arms up to the ceiling, and then just reach the body forward and just place your hands on the floor if you can and deep inhalation here sending gratitude to your body to yourself for completing a workout thank you for joining me and roll the spine up nice and tall 
once again. Thank you for joining me. I hope you'll have a great workout as she just did. I hope to see you again on a mat with the other videos in this channel. Leave some comment if you have any questions and I'll get back to you as soon as I can. Subscribe to the channel and I hope to see you in another class. Have a great day. Thank you.